Okay, first thing I'm going to do is wrap my Scion. One, two, three, four, five on this one. I won't bother with, I'll get rid of this one. I'm going to start from here. Here's my grafting tape. It's quite stretchy, as you will see. Okay, start off nice and keep all the moisture out. This tape should go all the way around. If not, I can use more tape. to help keep the moisture in. We'll just get a little bit more. Cover the top. Probably. Not my best work. Oh well. Let's cut here. <clears throat> it's about the same size here. This is a good match. So what I might do is say cliff graft. Just go down the middle. But yay deep. See that? And then I need to shape this. Angled cut. Not my best work, but oh well. Uh, you can see here it's lined up. It's lined up beautifully. I'll just zoom in a bit. Here you can see the cambium right there. Cambium here. This is on the scion wood. And it's a perfect match actually. So I'm just gonna push that down a little bit more. There we go. Done some more even. And if I turn it around, looks pretty snug in there. I'll just zoom out. <clears throat> zoom out.
Now what I'm going to do is, there we go, I'm going to cover that with more grafting tape. I could use something stronger than grafting tape just to bind this really tightly. In fact, that's what I'm going to do. Give me a sec. And here we have it. Good old electrical tape. So I'm going to start from low down. Good thing with electrical tape is you can put quite a bit of pressure on. Every time I turn, I'm pulling it tight. We need, we need both of these to be binding snugly like this. Yeah, see? Mm. Very good. So what I'm going to do now is use uh, a little piece of tape because it's still can't see but you see the top is still exposed so I'm going to use this grafting tape to finish it off how about this way there we go oh we don't want any moisture getting in There we have it. So that's almost done. One thing I like to do is even though this is wrapped in uh, grafting tape, I like to add one more layer and that's just a plastic bag. As a block bag is fine over the top like that so it's like a glass house perfect and I'm probably going to keep this inside this shed keep it out of the elements um, yeah I have been known to lose some that I've left outside and the in the elements, in the weather, but I'm going to keep this one inside. So the writing on here says reed. This scion is reed. The rootstock is a seedling, a Hass seedling. Reed graft wood or scion. That's it. Thank you. And that's how you graft a seedling.